Welcome to Duck River Homestead. Today we are going to be adding a DRO to the sawmill. A DRO is a digital readout. What that does is it allows us to set precise cuts to the fraction of an inch, 30 seconds, sixteenths, eighths, quarters, etc. That way we can make sure that our 2x4s are in fact 2x4s. The foundation. Okay, so I have the sensor connected to the gantry, uh, and then I'm going to have the rod connected to the saw head. I haven't drilled the holes for that yet, uh, but we'll get started on that shortly. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna find some uh, some three M double sided stick adhesive. I'll stick this right here. And then I'll be good. I really don't want to drill into this. So I'm gonna go get, grab some of that and I'll be right back. I'm gonna pause right there. If you are enjoying this video, if it's making your life even slightly better, really appreciate it if you liked the video, hit that like button. And if you wanna see more like this, consider subscribing to us. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm back. What I forgot to get is some uh, wire ties. I'll get that a little bit later. I'll get this junk out of the way. There we go. It's parallel. This should stick to the head up and down. The saw head is currently actually at one inch height. I just measured that. And in order to make sure this represents the true height of the cut, what I'm going to be doing is holding the preset. Now, if you're in fraction mode, you're gonna notice something. It doesn't actually work. So what I need to do is I need to move over from inch with fractions to inch with decimals. So let me hold that preset button again. So you'll see the P is gonna start flashing actually. It's gonna hold that down I set it to one inch. 
I'm going to move out. And I should be get set to go. Okay. So now I'm going to move back to fractions. Now, when I'm at the bottom, it'll go back down to one. And start lifting it up. See, I'm at two and a sixteenth. I'll try to get to three exactly. Went up a little too high. I'm bringing it back down. There we go. Should be a three right there. Now it's a little bit jerky because I need to put some lithium grease on these posts so that it goes up and down smoothly. It's squeaking a little too much. But that's that. We now have a digital readout for the sawmill head. Well, it was a very productive day. I was able to get the DRO digital readout connected, set up. Um, I need to tie it off with wire ties. I need to lube the, uh, the poles for the saw head because it's, it's just it's squeaking like crazy. We've got a lot of stuff coming up. We are, we'll be finishing up the foundation for the utility shed. We're going to start building the utility shed, running power, water to it. That's coming up very shortly. So keep on watching. We've got a lot of stuff coming your way. Thanks so much.